with the two sides, the back, fresh set of cables with the connectors all in and the little roundy runners. So what we need to do is clean all the cables, which has been done already. So we need some uh, white grease. Basically, make sure you, uh, you clean all the runners properly. As you can see, this is quite dirty. So it all needs to be cleaned. Okay, so what we'll do is slide it in. Same on the other side. Be generous with it. Okay, so you just slide it in. All the way to the end. What you do is you just Slide them in near the end, don't go to the end. About that, that's far enough. And then on this side, as you can see, this is on the inside there, that's on the outside there. So obviously, that goes into there, and that goes into there. And you just feed it in. A bit of grease in there as well. In here as well. Get all the angles. Just feed it through. This goes in like that, it goes into the first one or the last one, whichever way you look at it. It runs up. Slide the other side in. And obviously this now goes on the inside hole and the inside runner and the inside track. It's on the inside here, so it's on the inside and this side. Push it through. Just slide that back in. Like we did on the other side, different than the first one. Lift it up, it slides in. Now these bits here, these, they actually lock in down the bottom, so make sure when you slide them in that they, uh, they go in straight. And you'll actually feel it locking them in as well. So we'll feed it in. That's it. This one's in. We'll do the other side now. Wiggle it about. Takes the threaded one, this one does here. Push it in. Just make sure this is all in comfortably before you tighten it. There we go, we'll just tighten those down. Make sure there's no gap. It's flush. That's a self tapper. That's a threaded one. This is another threaded one. It goes in here. Okay, so here's the same. 
braided one goes in the middle, soft top for one goes at the end. Right on, like so. And these, as you can see, are all self tappers now. Okay, this here has got like a little joint. Just put it in. Put it closed. Okay, so now before we put in this gear, we need to make sure both of these are literally at the end here. So like so, so they're both at the end before you, you lock this in. So basically that is them, you're timing up both of them, they're straight. You gotta get this right, otherwise you'll break the cables but it just won't work, it just won't wind. So at this point, spray a bit of grease. So now with the handle on, you see it'll go back and it'll come forward. And they're both in time with each other. Okay, what we'll do is, with these, you put them down and slide it, slide it back like so. So slide them back slightly, about an inch. So it sits flat. Let me slide that in there. Slide it in. And there you go. It's in. What we'll do is we'll wind these adjusters in. Here now. push it up and you we slide these on into little brackets that hold the plate which we push the sunroof up slide the plate in push it up and you tighten them in this position with it pushed up all the way up slacking it off till it becomes tight. So it pushes against these. And then once that's done, you, you tighten them up. Perfect. 